May God Almighty bless you all. Peace and good to you. I am near Jesus in the Eucharist. This special place, this place of joy, peace and tranquility, of healing, this place full of hope, this place full of love. In fact, here we have love that is incarnated. Love that becomes one of, one of us. Love that gives us the joy, joyous peace we all need. And yet, there were people who mockingly mocked Jesus in the Eucharist. I am specifically referring to the disgusting performance of that heinous parody about the Holy Eucharist at the inauguration of the Olympic Games. It is heinous and it is so despicable because it shows that when humanity, when certain people mock real intimacy, they show their crisis of intimacy. They show their misery in intimacy. They show that they have a problem in loving others. So, united with all other people, me too denounce that parody on many levels. First of all, religion expression does, and freedom of expression does not mean the meaning other religious faiths. One right does not violate another's right. Otherwise, it becomes tyranny. Also, why Christianity becomes the target of such parodies? It is never good that other religions with Christianity becomes target of such things, it is always condemnable to do so. But I ask, why Christianity? Also, why when a certain faith leaves you and gives you the freedom to express yourself and you use that opportunity to hurt the people who have every right to worship that way. Why? History showed us that those who did this to other religions ended up very badly. We know. We know the stories. We heard them in the global media news. So why? We do this to Christianity. Why do we do this to all religions? Also, such a situation shows us the need to go back to our roots. France is a Catholic country and to find itself, it needs to recover back her Christian heritage. Also, all of us, when we respect each other's faiths, we are opening our spirits, our lives, to delve deeper in our relationship with God and to see God in one another. Finally, there are so many subjects that we can have a laugh at. But why using faith? Why using this sanctuary, this precious sanctuary that is the faith of a person, where that person meets God? Lord, forgive us of this senseless parody and with this blessing, touch our hearts to see with each other and
to find ways and means to amend for all this and to live in peace with you and one another. May God Almighty bless us in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. Amen.